Hello guys and welcome again. Guys, today I'll show you how to install Phonex Jailbreak using a new method that will not uh, require 3U tools or all store. It is very easy to use and it supports Windows. So if you are on iOS 9.3.6 or 9.3.5, you can install Phonex Jailbreak onto your device. So it supports iPad Mini 1 iPhone 4s, iPad 2, 3, 4 and it is uh, very easy to use so first of all download the IPA from this website the link is in the description next on this website the link is in the description you just need iTunes to be installed either 64 or 32 bit depending on your computer and you need to download this software that is sideloadly it supports windows i have already downloaded it and installed it so let me quickly take you let me open the app first ok so guys i have connected my ipad mini 1 alright by usb as you can see it is not jailbroken i need to kick start the jailbreak and you can see phonex is not installed so just open this app and uh, select the IPA that you have downloaded earlier. Alright guys, I am going to install Phonix. Just click open. And here enter your Apple ID. Alright, so I have already entered my Apple ID here. Now, I will just click start. I have used this app earlier. So it is not asking me for the password. So if you are using it for the first time, it will ask you for the password of uh, this Apple ID. So as you can see, it is signing the Phonix app. Alright, it is now extracting the package, rewriting the application, very fine. So you can see it is being installed. Alright, you can see it says done and Phonex is on my iPad. So if you open, you will see this message. Just cancel it out. Go to settings and uh, general. Scroll down to device management. Click the ID, trust and trust again. Alright, now let's open the app. Yes, it is working. So now let's kick start the jailbreak. So if you are jailbreaking for the first time, it will say jailbreak here. So let me kick start and then show you that CDI is working. Use provided offset. So guys, it is now jailbreaking it. Now the iPad uh, will respring. Right guys, we are back after the respring. So you can see it says that my iPad is still broken. Now if I open CDR. So guys, everything is working. Sources are working, changes are working. So it is now shell broken. So guys. You can use this app and uh, if you have any questions you can ask me in the comments and thanks a lot for watching my video until then.